Family and friends of Gamboa were in tears as the video played and Johnson on it is shown clearly explaining what he says happened. About four weeks after Bellamy Gamboa disappeared in July 2018, Virginia Beach police arrested her ex-boyfriend Lamont Johnson on charges he left his and Gamboa's kids home alone on several occasions. They then brought Johnson into the Virginia Beach police station for questioning. All of the conversation was recorded and today prosecutors played jurors the video during the second day of Johnson's second degree murder trial. At first, Johnson seems evasive and says he did not kill Gamboa, but as the hours go by, you see his body language change. At one point, his hands are on his head. And then a sergeant comes in and really puts pressure on Johnson to fess up to what happened. Johnson says he will once he has a smoke break. He comes back in, hugs one of the detectives, apologizes for lying, and proceeds to calmly explain what happened. In his own words, Johnson says he and Gamboa had been arguing about paying rent. He pushed her, she fell down the stairs, he then also fell down the stairs. She says she's calling the police. He then says, quote, I snapped and pushes her to the ground and chokes her until she's no longer moving. He says he immediately thinks about calling the police saying, quote, what the hell just happened? But is concerned about what would happen to his kids. So he decides to wrap her up in a comforter and in the middle of the night, he says he put her body in a dumpster in Chesapeake. He tells the detectives he did feel some relief at first, saying, quote, I got to pay daycare, but at least I have some peace. But as he continues to talk to the detectives, the weight of what he just admitted seems to catch up to him. He says, quote, I'm just a huge disappointment to my whole family. Now, Johnson didn't actually want this video to be played during the trial, but last year during a hearing, a judge ruled it could be shown during the trial. Johnson said that he was coerced by police into making the confession. Now, tomorrow the prosecution will continue their case, and then the defense will get their chance. We'll keep you updated on what happens. In Virginia Beach, Brendan Ponton, News 3.